Hey guys, welcome to my next vlog for The Haunting of Hill House. We're looking at episode 8 this time, and right off the bat, this is a fantastic episode. This was so much better than the last episode, which was really good, but this one really picked up. This was incredible and something we really needed. It's like a race to the finish line type of episode. Um, it just has so much packed into it that is both interesting, creepy, and just altogether a satisfying episode. The episode deals with, at the end of last episode, Luke disappeared and went off somewhere, and this episode deals with, um, Timothy Hutton, who plays, a uh, Hugh Crane, and, uh, the son, Stephen, going to find him, where he's actually going to Hill House to confront his demons, and this episode deals a lot with their relationship, and has a really fantastic part where, Timothy Hutton talks to his son Stephen about the evil of that house and, like, how it consumes you. And it was just incredibly well done from beginning to end. This episode didn't have a dull moment in it. Everything felt so important to the story and it just flowed so well. Mike Flanagan, again, knocks it out of the park. He's just such a talented writer and director, and he just really knows how to do the best job with the actors, with the atmosphere, everything. Everything is just so perfectly well done and presented in this episode. It's so much fun and very emotional. It's incredible and I just really like what's going on in the show. I like the questions it asks such as are people really seeing ghosts or are they legitimately crazy? That's something that this show has been playing around with a bit such as um well are people just crazy? Like there's that and I really like this idea that they play into such as mental illness being um, tied to people seeing spirits or ghosts and are they really seeing spirits or ghosts or not and this, this delves into that and I think that's really interesting and just really really good because you even start to think to yourself. There's little clues here and there throughout the episode where you're thinking to yourself, well, are they crazy? Is this family legitimately crazy or are they really seeing ghosts? And I think that's a nice little thing that the show does and doesn't give you a full answer, at least for now, but I really really enjoyed this episode, and the ending just left me wanting more. I can't wait to watch the next episode. I'm not even going to wait. As soon as I finish this video, I'm going to watch the next episode, and who knows, I might watch the final episode. I'm just, just astounded by how good this show is. It's just extremely well written, well acted, just everything from the directing to the acting is just fantastic. These characters feel like real people and I just love every single one of them. This show has just surprised me again and again and that's really special. We've got a really special show here and I can't wait to continue on. But yeah, guys, that's really all I got to say for this episode. I really enjoyed it, and I can't wait for the next one. So, as always, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you guys in the next vlog.